Breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. There will be no seat at home as court renders its decision on Unamde Kano's case. IPOB. There will be no seat at home as court renders its decision on Unamde Kano's case. IPOB. To my dear listeners from wherever you're listening from, Stay tuned as I read today's news. The indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, has announced that there will be no seats at home in the southeast next week on Wednesday and Thursday. Due to the expected verdict of the High Court sitting in Abia State, IPOB decided to end its seat at home campaign. Kano's fundamental rights claim will be decided by the court on Wednesday. IPOP spokesman Ima Powerful said the stay at home order was only in effect until Tuesday when Kano is scheduled to appear before Justice Bintaunyako of an Abuja Federal High Court. The ruling, according to Powerful, was made to allow residents in the southeast to go about their normal business while the court considers Kano's fundamental rights claim. According to a statement released on Saturday, Powerful stated that they had the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, under the leadership of Mazi Unamdikanu. Following their leader's future court appearances on 18th, 19th, and 20th of January 2022, they would like to remind Biafran that only the 18th of January will be sit at home, not the 19th and 20th. For obvious reasons, the entire Biafra territory will be on lockdown exclusively on January 18, in keeping with their pledged unity with their leader. In his words, Biafrans should be aware that the 19th of January is the deadline for our leader suit against the federal government to be had in Umaya High Court as a result there will be no seat at home day on that particular day. Powerful noted that they don't want to add to their people's suffering. Therefore, there will be they will confine the seat into only January 18. On the 19th and 20th of January, Biafrans and inhabitants of Biafra are free to go about their daily lives without fear of being harassed. Powerful stated that anyone observed enforcing the seat at home order on those days will not was not a member of IPOB. The indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, has announced that there will be no seat at home in the southeast next week on Wednesday and Thursday. Due to the expected verdict of the High Court sitting in Abuja, Hypop decided to end its seat at home campaign. Kano's fundamental rights claim will be decided by the court on Wednesday. Hypop spokesman Emma Powerful said. The stay at home order was only in fact until Tuesday when Kanu is scheduled to appear before Justice Binta Unyako of an Abuja Federal High Court. The ruling, according to Powerful, was made to allow residents in the Southeast to go about their normal business while the court considers Kano's fundamental rights claim. 
according to a statement released on Saturday. Powerful stated that they are the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB under the leadership of Mazi Unamde Kanu, following their leader's future court appearances on the 18th, 19th, and 20th of January 2022. They would like to remind Biafrans that only the 18th of January will be sit at home not the 19th and 20th for obvious reasons the entire biafra territory will be on lockdown exclusively on january 18 in keeping with their pledged unity with their leader in his words biafrans should be aware that the 19th of january is the deadline for our leader suit against the federal government to be had in Umaya High Court. As a result, there will be no seat at home day on that particular day. Powerful noted that they don't want to add to their people's suffering. Therefore, they will confine the seat at home to only January 18. On the 19th and 20th of January, Biafran and inhabitants of Biafra are free to go about their daily lives without fear of being aroused. Powerful stated that anyone observed enforcing, enforcing the sit-at-home order on those days was not a member of IPOB, the indigenous people of Biafra. Hypop has announced that there will be no seat at home in the southeast next week on Wednesday and Thursday. Due